How does communication influence sexual satisfaction in a couple? What are the best practices for improving sexual communication in couples? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Open and honest communication is essential for sexual satisfaction in a couple. It allows expressing desires, needs, and boundaries, facilitating better understanding and connection. Improving sexual communication in a relationship is crucial. Best practices include honesty, respect, empathy, and a willingness to openly discuss desires, needs, and boundaries. Effective communication can strengthen intimacy and sexual satisfaction in a partnership. Age and orgasm. As women age, they often find it easier to reach orgasm. This is due to increased knowledge of their bodies and greater confidence in sexual intimacy. Love and sex. Love and sex are closely related in the human experience. Emotional intimacy can significantly enhance sexual satisfaction, and sex can strengthen emotional bonds. The combination of love and sex can be a source of enrichment in relationships. Authenticity. Being authentic and showing oneself without pretending to be someone else can be very attractive to many people. The orgasm gap refers to the difference in orgasm frequency between men and women in heterosexual relationships. Open communication and equality in sexual satisfaction are key to closing this gap. Cervical orgasm. Some women report experiencing cervical orgasms, which feel deeper and may last longer than clitoral orgasms. The coitus interruptus method, involving withdrawing the penis before ejaculation to prevent pregnancy, is one of the least effective contraceptive methods. It is often called the withdrawal method. Common practice. Despite associated stigmas, anal sex is a common sexual practice and can be enjoyed by many couples as an additional form of intimacy. Communication. The ability to communicate effectively and actively listen is important. Women often value open and honest communication in a relationship. Tickling and sex. Tickling can play an unusual role in sexual arousal. Some people find that stimulation of certain erogenous zones can induce both tickling and pleasure simultaneously. Abstinence culture. In some cultures and religions, sexual abstinence before marriage is a norm. However, attitudes toward abstinence have changed over time. Delayed ejaculation. Some men may experience delayed ejaculation, meaning they have difficulty reaching orgasm during sexual intercourse. This can be due to emotional or physical factors. National Condom Day. In some countries, National Condom Day is celebrated to promote awareness of the importance of condom use in preventing sexually transmitted diseases and unwanted pregnancies. Diversity in sexual preferences. Sexual preferences vary widely among individuals. Some may be attracted to the same sex, opposite sex, or both, identifying as heterosexual, homosexual, bisexual, or pansexual. Diversity of sexual orientations. Sexual orientation is diverse and goes beyond heterosexuality. It includes orientations such as homosexuality, bisexuality, pansexuality, and many others. Each person has their own unique orientation. Sex education varies widely worldwide. Some countries have comprehensive sex education programs in schools, while in others, sex education is limited or non-existent. Sex education in the Netherlands. The Netherlands is known for its comprehensive sex education, starting at an early age and focusing on open communication and consent. This has led to lower rates of teenage pregnancy and sexually transmitted diseases compared to other countries. Classical music's effect. It has been observed that classical music, particularly Vivaldi's Autumn, can increase sexual arousal. 
Scientists believe this is due to the rhythm and structure of the music, which may match the rhythm of sexual activity. Stress's effect on fertility, chronic stress, can have a negative impact on fertility in both men and women. Stress can affect sex hormones and reduce the ability to conceive. Effects on the brain. During a female orgasm, multiple areas of the brain are activated, including the hypothalamus, which regulates pleasure, and the amygdala related to emotions. This may explain why orgasms are often accompanied by intense feelings of happiness and stress relief. Ejaculation issues. Men may experience various ejaculation-related problems, such as premature ejaculation, delayed ejaculation, difficulty reaching orgasm, or an ejaculation, inability to ejaculate. Studies on the clitoris. Despite the importance of the clitoris in female sexual response, there has been a lack of research on this organ compared to the penis. However, there has been an increased focus on clitoral research in recent years. Evolution of pornography. Pornography has evolved significantly with the advent of the internet. It is now instantly accessible and offers a wide variety of content. Lack of sexual education. Despite the importance of sexual education, many societies lack adequate sexual education programs, leading to misunderstandings and health risks. Sexual fantasies are a normal part of human sexuality. They can range from romantic situations to bolder and more experimental encounters. Fetishes are atypical sexual interests, including a wide range of objects, body parts, or situations. Fetishes are common and can be a healthy part of a person's sexual life if approached consensually and safely. Focus on mutual pleasure. Like in any sexual activity, focusing on mutual pleasure and the well-being of both parties is essential for a positive experience. Health effects. Female orgasms can have positive health effects, such as reducing stress, improving sleep, and relieving menstrual pain they can also strengthen pelvic floor muscles. History of condoms. Condoms have a long history dating back to ancient Rome, where they were made from animal intestines. Today, modern condoms are made of latex or polyurethane and are an effective means of protecting against STIs and unwanted pregnancies. The importance of foreplay. Foreplay is essential for a satisfying sexual experience. Emotional and physical stimulation before sexual activity can increase arousal and intimacy. The importance of touch, physical contact, such as hugs and massages, releases oxytocin, the love hormone, promoting emotional bonding and intimacy in relationships. Influence of technology on sexuality. Technology has changed how people experience sexuality. Online connected applications and sexual toys are examples of how technology has integrated into modern sexual life. Sexual inhibitors. Some medications can have sexual side effects. Sexual inhibitors, such as some antidepressants, may reduce sexual desire or make arousal and orgasm more difficult. It is important to talk to a healthcare professional if experiencing these effects. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.